What's going on guys, Bengal again here, coming back at you with another video. Week 15, we're facing the 8-5 Washington football team. Clearly not in the playoffs anymore, but we're on a bit of a winning streak. I think two in a row? No, not two in a row. We're 3-10, and ten, but we've won three out of our last five. So, pretty good. Washington football team, they're fighting, clawing, holding on to a playoff spot. It is still early. I mean, there's a lot of time to go before the end of the season. But we can get in here. We can finish the season strong. Get a big win. Let's go after it. Let's get after it. Let's beat WFT. They're really good. I don't think it's going to go too well. I think we're going to get pressured a lot. But yeah, we're not throwing in the towel. Beat the football team for a significant boost to your roster. We got, the, got this at the end of last season. And what happened? I think it was like three players on our team, like the best three on each side of the ball, maybe. Or the, maybe just the best three overall got boosts. But I don't know what that's going to do this year. Because maybe it wasn't the best three overall players. I think it was just set positions, like middle linebacker got a boost. But I, I mean, clearly our middle linebackers are... Not guys that I think are going to be here long term. Jeff Okuda is going to be CB2 again. Chris Harris Jr. is just burnt toast. I like the team, but the bottom line is we have to play better. We have to play better. We've been getting better of late, but it is still not good enough. Still not good enough. As for scouting, I think I'm going to check out right guard today. I'm hoping for some talent from someone on the offensive line. It's just not a good whole line class at all. Like everyone we look at, like sucks a lot. George Guerrero's maybe okay for a seventh rounder with B plus run block, but the guys suck a lot. That's just where we are. It's really unfortunate, but this would be a huge win. To get that boost to the roster, I think would be awesome. And defending the outside run, yeah, all right. I mean, it feels like it feels like this is a really good running team that can't throw the ball. And in order to combat the morale, we need the best, uh, the best, biggest boost possible. So we're gonna go full pads, blitz counter. I like it, and get some of these guys upgraded. We're not gonna get five sacks. I know we did last week, but mm, I guess our O line is not fantastic. The odds of that I just feel like are real low let's do 350 yards passing it, it is doable all right need guys to stay healthy need to win this game we've been playing better i have a new approach as you guys have noticed probably i have a new approach on offense and it's just play more conservatively and it's been extremely effective overall so clearly we just have to keep doing that just don't switch up no injuries. We're at full strength, even though that's pretty weak overall. And uh, we should get in here. It's a good team we're facing. Their defense is great. Frank Ragnow with an upgrade. Okay, Frank. Can he run block at all? Can't even pass block. He's got 88 pass protector and run block and pass block are so low. It's a little confusing. It's a little confusing, I'm not going to lie. Um, let's do power. That's run blocking, so we'll try and get that upgraded a bit. And plus two strength is actually massive. That's a crazy upgrade to just get randomly. Plus two strength. Strength is a big, big, big attribute for alignment in this game on both sides of the ball. That's crazy we just got a plus two strength just randomly. I'm in. But this is not going to be an easy game. We're rocking... The black alternate unis. Watch out. Watch out for this team. Paul Garrison. Alex Soto ready to go in if need be. We play a little wild with Paul Garrison at times. So injury, I guess, could pop up. But here we go. We have momentum. We're the home team. Let's keep it. Let's keep it. Their quarterback is Colin Kaepernick. Colin Kaepernick 
is their quarterback. All right. Well, all right. That's all I got on that one. All right. It's a pitch. Oh, great tackle to Sean Hand. And Logan Thomas is injured. This is what I like to see. Play dirty, take some guys out of the game. Hey, bring out a knife, tear some ACLs that way if you have to. We need every advantage we can get. Injure these virtual players. That's got to be... Ah, man, Kaepernick's just going to sling it, huh? All right. Third and four. We've been having a lot of success recently when we send pressure on teams. This is not the best O-line in the world. They do have Brandon Sheriff, who's quite a good player. I just got beaten man coverage. Big hit, but no fumble. We don't get fumbles with Derek Davidson. It's sad. To run... Oh, Davidson popped him right in the mouth. Oh my goodness, that's fun. I'd love a fumble on one of those. Anytime. Anytime one of those would be great. Third and three, run left. Do I commit to the run here? It was a bad decision, but I mean, oh my goodness. Clemens, big tackle. We just need guys to wrap up in the box like that. I keep trying to send a lot of heat. It's not really working out. That's super open. Anzalone saves the touchdown. Don't let it be for not. Football team's driving down the field right now. I'm in man coverage. Oh, I really don't like this. What could he probably be running? It's in or out. I don't think he's standing still. He stood still. Somebody didn't do their job. It was Tracy Walker. Man's tough in that spot. We're going to go down 7 nothing. Unstoppable drive there by Washington football team. They just did everything right. Call and play action. Just going to see what they do here. Just going to see what they do. That's open. Garrison hits Rashad Reese. Would have been a super nice tackle to break, but it's a 17-yard pickup on first down. Can't complain about that. Reese letting our own bench know. Hyping up the team. Love to see it. Get the defense going. We're going to run the football. Get outside. Man, Swifty's got to run through that tackle. Third and seven. This is an example of a play that I really don't like. I mean, it's a beautiful touch pass. I love it. I don't like it. I love it. I want some more of it. Paul Garrison. Just great timing on that. Hawkinson got bumped. Didn't matter. Didn't matter. Got it to him anyway. Let's run left side. I feel like we have numbers advantage there. All right. That's a good tackle. Whenever I run right, like, it looks like we have more space. It looks like we have blockers. But I notice things just get really... Oh, man, that's another sick tackle. We had it with DeAndre Swift. I notice things just get a little bit congested. There's just a lot of players in the area. I feel like it's a little bit tougher to navigate at times. It's third and one. Do we run the ball here? I actually want to flip the play. Just want to run away from their, their main talent. And that's really just, it comes down to Chase Young. Jonathan Allen is awesome, but... Reese, please. Oh my goodness, we're going to be short. Fourth and one from the 28. We're going to take our points. We're going to take our points. I think if we were a little bit further back, we would uh, try to go for it on fourth and one. But we're going to take our points. Seven to three. A little bit disappointed about the way that drive ended. Look at Dorian Tompkins. Oh, that's a... Oh, my goodness. That was destroyed. Yeah, that was put on a tee. Dorian Tompkins hit it out of the park. Insta shed, insta pop. And the fact that he didn't go down to the ground, Dorian Tompkins, I mean, he would have gotten after Kaepernick had that been play action. To draw. Jamie Collins, nice tackle. Third and long for Washington football team. This is where I want to call. Yeah. I want to call a safety blitz. Now, I can understand wanting to just play man coverage or something. I, maybe not man, but maybe like a conservative zone. I want to force the ball out on third and long early. So that's what they do, and they can't get it. Fourth and seven. Play call worked to perfection. And we're going to get the football back. So we trust the defense even after the first drive being fairly unsuccessful from our defense perspective. 
But your defense did the job this time. Got the football back. And uh, let's see if we can score. Let's run the ball. It is second and long, but I love the defense we're running against. Well, okay. Chase Young is a different animal. That's the problem. It's like, stuff like that works when the team you're playing isn't great. But a guy like Chase Young has such elite recovery speed there. That it just didn't work the way I wanted it to. But there's Rashad Reese. Beautiful throw on the run. Rashad Reese is a different animal. Oh my goodness. Someone find the football! Oh, um, no one's going to tackle him. Jonathan Allen with basic... Oh, wait, no, we got to him. But, uh, dude. What a play. Oh, that's frustrating. Running out of empty. DeAndre Swift got covered. I wanted the play back across, but you can see the same exact guy that took away DeAndre Swift bumped my other option, and they just got pressure instantly. My right tackle did literally... Taylor Decker is a waste, of, a waste of space. Oh my goodness, man. Defense played well. Guess what? Guys on offense aren't doing their job. And we give the football away just like that. Oh my god. Just got steamrolled. Quick throw. I mean, Derek Davidson. I don't know if he was in man coverage there, but completely did not have any idea where his man was. 14 to 3. Damn. That's what good teams play like, though. We got to play better. We're down to the game. We don't need to feel forced to throw the ball yet. There's a lot of time. Good block. Good juke from DeAndre Swift. He breaks the tackle, stays in bounds. Let's go, DeAndre. That's why we can run the ball. Just don't like their defensive line, man. It's so good. Nothing doing on that one. Five attempts for six yards for Rashad Reese. Last week, he had eight rushes for 80 yards or 10 for 80. I think it was 10 for 80. We're going to find him as a receiver, though. Is that open enough? DeAndre Swift, we need you to break these tackles. We need you to break these tackles. That's okay, though. Ooh, and I like this. TJ Hawkinson in the slot. It's a really big spot for a block. He didn't hold it. He didn't hold it. We're going to try running the ball again. If we get stopped here and it's fourth and one or fourth and inches, this is where I would certainly consider going for it. Rashad Reese is just fighting for the first. And he got it. Solomon Clifford in. We're going to give him a run. We're going to see what Solomon Clifford's all about. Just try, I, Sometimes with these power backs, I just... I get too caught up with finding you know, one-on-one -on -one spots and maybe not letting the actual blocks develop. Searching for contact. Didn't work there. Do we have that? Swifty! Didn't catch it. Falls incomplete. Pass was a tad high. And it's third and nine. I need Chris Godwin to get separation. They need to be in, like, cover two or something for this to be super effective. And they're not. Thrown back across. Quintez Cephas! And it's another situation where it's fourth and short. The CPU wants me to go for it. I don't think it's the right call. I don't think it's the right call on this spot. Because making it 14 to 6, we at least get points on the board. It's fourth and three. I don't know that I trust our team to convert this. And a touchdown and a two-point conversion now ties the game. I think making that 14 to 6 is a better call. So that's why I'm the head coach. I'm going to overrule. And we are going to... Uh, Get some points on the board. Staying in the game. Live to die another day. We need to take momentum back, man. Momentum is so huge in this game. We need to take it back. It's a draw. And it's a loady big hit. Fumble the ball. Cough it up one time for me, would you? Kaepernick gonna run. Throws a cross body. I never sent anybody after him. And I'm going after him myself, personally. And the guy covering Terry McLaurin. Just like, ah, I'm going to leave him. Kaepernick, impossible crossbody throw. Makes it. Oh, he's going to stay in bounds there? 
How many tackles can you possibly break? Oh, almost a pick. That's right, the ball spot's gone, so that was kind of a weird one. It's just like the ball floating in the air without the uh, spot on the field. First and 10. Lobbed up. That's going to be a touchdown. Chris Harris Jr. just can't stick with him. They got Terry McLaurin in the slot. Feels unfair. <laughs> touchdown. 21-6. to six. It's all right. There's still time to score. Until, still time to score before the half. All right. Minute and a half. Man, I really wanted to throw the deep ball. On the run, inaccurate. Oh, man, I thought about running. I was really going to run, and then I'm like, we have a better chance to convert this through the air. That's sometimes why I just, uh, I like to run instead. Can we throw that? Cephas can't come down with it. And Montez Sweat's injured. See, that now we're back to playing our game. Injure the other team, and we might have a chance. Third down and 10. I like Tyrell Williams as a clear out. I'm, I'm, I got a lot of clear out action going on. Chris Godwin maybe just on a quick little curl. Get positioning and he drops the ball. How do you drop that? How much money do I give to Chris Godwin to not drop that? Butterfingers. It looks like real life Chris Godwin right now. Killing me. Still no ball spot. Kind of weird, especially on punts. And now Washington football team is a real chance to score before the half ends. How is this happening? Lack of an offense. Also, to be fair, lack of a defense. Kaepernick's 15 of 15 for 182 and three touchdowns. And we just haven't been able to compete. Scary Terry, super open. Warrior can't get to him. I mean, this is unreal. Our defense does not stand a chance. Kaepernick finally goes down. Timeout Washington football team. Couldn't tell who applied the pressure, but that is a, that's a super big play. That is a super big play. Just kill their momentum a little bit. Kill their momentum even just a little bit. Gives us a chance to actually make some plays. Kaepernick, as all day, throws it away. Man, we really need to block this. We really need a missed kick. And it's right down the middle. 34 seconds, three timeouts. It's unlikely that we'll score here. It's really unlikely. We're down by a lot. We really need points right now. And at this point, do I regret trying the field goals? I mean, yes and no. Because, like, obviously, there's a chance we wouldn't get them anyway. But maybe we do. And maybe we have, instead of six points right now, but we, maybe we have 14. But, you know, also having some points is better than no points. Quick throw, super open, Rashad Reese. We want to save that clock. There is still time to come back. There's also time to go over the middle of the field. Get up the field. Why am I not on Hawkinson? Let's go, Paul. Stepped out of bounds as well. I tried to playmaker TJ Hawkinson to take that block up the field. Instead, I just basically had to stick on his ass and, uh, and ride the block, essentially. But... It's first and ten, 19 seconds. I'm worried about this. Cephas, feet and bounds. We were basically on the line there. Almost threw over it, but this is good. We're driving down the field. 13 seconds. Here's play action. Godwin. Got it to him. Timeout. Six seconds. What do we do here? They want us to take the field goal. Do we have a shot? Do we have a shot in us? They're leaving Godwin. They're leaving Godwin. It's going to have to be a quick throw. Garrison. Godwin open. Fit it in the window. Touchdown. That's how you do it. Big drive to end the first half. And we're going to go for two right now. We're gonna go for two right now. Let me put let me put Rashad Reese on a little whip. I don't think they're gonna cover that. Slant. 
Hopefully those uh, create a nice little natural pick. And Rashad Reese is so open, it's ridiculous. 24-14. That's a huge comeback to end the first half. That's huge. That's huge. No squib kick. When they take that, it's, oh, it's L1 now. I'm sure it's been that way for years. Haven't noticed. A little squib to end the first half. And you know what? We battled back big time. We battled back huge. They gave me the seam with Chris Godwin. Super peculiar, but we'll take it. All right, we get the ball to start the second half. I'm really, I'm proud of this team, right? I'm proud of this team. Be faster, DeAndre Swift. Be faster. 15-yard gain, just basically running with these guys from sideline to sideline. Rolling out. Hit the throw. Rashad Reese, two feet inbounds. We're still moving the chains. Look at Paul Garrison's line. 12 of 16. 193 yards and two touchdowns. We're turning this game around. We're making this comeback. This is unlike what we've seen the entire year. Usually, if we get the lead, we're blowing it. And if we go down, we're losing. No matter what. But we are fighting. Didn't give up. We're still down by 10, right? But... I mean, there's a lot of hope. There's a lot of hope. Jonah Jackson is horrific. Dude sucks. Is Hawk going to get open here? Ah, uh, we maybe had a little bit of a window for it. We have that still. Tyrell Williams! What a throw! What a catch! Tyrell Williams touchdown! Unbelievable! On the run, Paul Garrison... Throws it to the open Tyrell Williams, who turned around, found the football, had the presence of mind to get two feet down, or did he? I'm going to say, I'm going to pray, I'm going to hope that he did it. Did Tyrell Williams get two feet down? They're going to say he did. And we are down by a field goal, just like that. What a throw from Garrison, but really what's impressive on that is Tyrell Williams turning around, locating the football, getting the two feet down, and we have climbed all the way back. Trying to cover everything. They're going deep. Tracy Walker! We'll take an incompletion. We'll take that. Only the second incompletion of the game for Colin Kaepernick. It's open. I need a big tackle from Soro. Got the first. It's okay, though. The lack of a real CB1, I think, is super apparent with this team. Big tackle. Anzalone helped out. Okuda started it and then missed. Couldn't wrap up, but he slowed him down. Second and 11. Man, Derek Davidson in man coverage on Terry McLaurin. I got to change that. That's just a bad, bad thing. That's super open. I don't know who was covering who on that. Third and three. Quick throw. I think he got two feet down. They're going to give him the first. Oh, my. I mean, I think he got two feet down for sure. There's no point to challenge a play like that. It would really just be the spot, and I, I don't think that's going to change via review. Play action. That had to be an interception. You can't throw into traffic like that and have nothing. Had to be a pick. Third and six. We have not been able to get off the field on third down all game. Get off the field. Kaepernick misses. We'll take it. We're going to get the football back. Touchdown. Takes the lead. I'm so proud of this team, man. It's open enough. Quintez Cephas. Big first down. We can still run the ball, though. Garrison's just been electric through the air. You almost don't want to, but we got to remember we can run the ball. When it's effective, we can continue to do it. I want to run it to the right. I know it doesn't look like we have numbers, but running towards the short side of the field, I feel like he's just been more successful for us than not usually. Probably picked the wrong direction. Needed to keep following that. Second and eight. And I don't usually run the football in these spots, but... Gonna do it here. Good block. Rashad Reese. 
Big gain. That, oh my goodness, dude. I didn't mean to low pass that, so. I mean, I just, I guess I hit L2. We just got bailed on a roughing the passer. I mean, it was a drop pick anyway. We had Rashad Reese wide open, and I accidentally low passed it. I mean, that would have been a huge play. Let's call play action. Let's just take what's there. Ah, it's, that's, I wish I hadn't. We need clear outs. Roll out. Roll out. Actually, we're going to run. Rashad Reese. Let's go, baby. No fumble from Garrison either. Vanilla Vic. Merch link in the description. Teespring. Pick yourself up. Pick yourself up. Some Vanilla Vic merchandise. Would love you a long time. Make sure to tweet at me when you get it. Big run. I don't know if I like this run here on second and five. That's an interception. There's a flag. Um, now, that was really awful for a lot of reasons. The first reason uh, is I didn't know it was an RPO. That's kind of like my, my favorite move. Get RPOs out of my fucking playbook. Can we do that? Because I never know when it's an RPO. It's a pick six. The flag is for throwing too late. Illegal man downfield. It's going to be a pick six. It, I didn't know it was a pass. I found out so late. It's going to be the difference in the game. I'm going to lose the game because of that. I just expected a run for... Until I threw the pick six. I mean, I guess there's got to be clear play art telling me that that's an RPO, right? <laughs> I hate them. I, RPOs suck. Maybe there's one or two that are good in the game, but all I do is turn over the football there. I'm so I'm so mad. Like the fact that an RPO is taking up the spot of an actual run when I audible. That makes me really mad. Everything about it makes me furious. Because I'm trying to run the ball there. God! Let's go, Rashad Reese. It's dangerous, but you know what? It worked. I'm so, I'm so mad I threw a pick there. And it's going to be the difference in the game. Alright, we can calm down and we can, we, can, we can win this one. That's just infuriating. I mean, there's no other way around it. It's just infuriating. I'm throwing it deep. Reese, it's going to be picked. We had a step. It's just underthrown every time. It's underthrown every time. You know what I would love for my quarterback? How about make it so the only guy that can get a shot at the ball is the receiver? Overthrow it. I don't care. Do not underthrow it. And also, whenever I get rattled like that, I just start playing real bad. I just got to settle down. Make the read. Make the throw wide open. Hawkinson, please. First down. I passed lit inside, and you know where that ball was not? Inside. Could have been disastrous. No, I'm still... I'm, I just get so mad, man. Alright, on to the next plays. Forget about it. Man, I'm, I'm dropping back pretty far. Garrison fumbled out of bounds for two yards. That's a smart play. <laughs> We're running out of time. Rashad Reese is so explosive. We just gotta, we just gotta cap off this drive with a touchdown. But the thing is, we need it like right now. We have to score because we need to stop. And it, this team's been so tough to stop. It's been so tough to stop this team. We get a timeout there though. Jameen Davis is or Jamin Davis, by the way, not Jameen. Jamin Davis injured on that play gives us a nice little timeout. Thank you for your sacrifice. Can we get that ball in there? I really feel like we could. I really felt like we could. Let me take another look. Like, I guess it needed to come out earlier. It's just a weird animation, man. I wish you would turn around and just shield the football didn't happen. This slant's going to get picked off by the free safety. The coverage I expected did not happen. We're running with Garrison. Paul Garrison. Dive! Touchdown! Vanilovic! Paul Garrison extends. 
leaps through the air and gets the goal line. Touchdown, Lions. It was a dangerous dive and it paid off. A lot of time left in this game. We need a stop. Down by a field goal. Can you imagine if I didn't throw that dumbass pick six? RPOs, man. I, I wish we could take those three letters out of the alphabet. How do we stop Colin Kaepernick? Words that the NFL has been saying for years. Ah, man, there's no way to do it. Shed the block. We need a big hit. Fumble the ball one time. It's like Derek Davidson. It looks like he smacks guys, but it's like it's like getting stung by a bee. Like it hurts for a second, and then you're like, oh, who cares? That's what that is. Oh, huge incompletion. Huge incompletion. Fourth and two from the 42. If I'm Washington football team, I definitely go for this. They are not going to, though. And they're going to actually pin us deep. That was a good punt. To the 15. They get like 30 yards of field positioning. We need to make that back. But a touchdown gives us the lead. Just making sure this is not an RPO. Just got to be sure now. It's not a good run. Worried to call a screen just because I know Chase Young's going to read this. Oh, he didn't. He didn't. Please give me a block. Let's go Rashad. First down. Calling it to the other side. This might even be more effective. Another first down, actually. Just 10 yards. Hawkinson. We're just going to take what we can get. Do we try and make this the final drive of the game? I think we have to. I think we have to. And running against this safety blitz here is going to be a really good idea. We just got to over team or overmatch Chase Young. That's what we did. Big first down from DeAndre Swift. I'm loving what I'm seeing. Let's run the ball here. Oh, this is an RPO. I see it. I see it on the screen. I got to get out of that. Disaster waiting to happen. They tried to set me up. I know what they're doing. And now it's going to be third and three, maybe? Third and four. The problem with this being the final drive is if I don't convert, the game ends. That's the big problem that I can see right now. Uh, we had stuff. We still have stuff. Garrison, you got to get it there. Rashad Reese stays in bounds. Well, steps out after, but got the catch. Just freak out sometimes. I, I don't want to force the ball so bad that I can't get rid of it. It worked out for the best in the end anyway. I'm just making sure this is not a surprise RPO. And they're going for the football. We might have to get Rashad Reese out of the backfield. Because that's uh, extremely dangerous. But we're in field goal range now. We just have to not blow the game. It's the big goal. That's always the goal, really. Quick throw. Hawkinson will take the guaranteed yardage. And we're going to take that to the two-minute warning as well. Oof. All right. Really, really, really big third down. We have momentum, though. You got to know I cannot, 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 cannot. Am I saying cannot enough? I cannot run the ball here. What do you have? Away team has trouble catching. That would be big. I need this whip to get open. Tyrell Williams. Good timing. First down. Did he get end goal? Might be first and goal from the 10. It is first and goal. That's okay, though. They are aggressively going for the strips now. Rashad Reese in the backfield is dangerous because of that. First and goal. Rashad Reese. There's a flag. It's going to be a hold. It's going to be a hold. Oh, it's not. It's roughing the passer. I think we declined this. Actually, you know what? No, we don't. First and goal. First and goal. First and goal. Now, the reason I thought about declining it is because the clock would keep moving. I should have declined it because I, I basically don't want to score on this play. We scored. I should have declined it. Damn. Big touchdown, Rashad Reese. 35-31. 
There's a lot of time left. A minute and 11. Three timeouts. They need a touchdown. I just worry that all it takes is one throw to the end zone. You know my guys are going to get mossed. You know we're going to get mossed. Deep pass catching. Conservative. Or, hold on. Increase. What is the pro? Always trigger a rack attempt? Oh. So I guess we can't get mossed. I don't really know what to do. We're going to do... We'll do conservative as well. Just keep them in front of you. And we'll... Uh, we'll take it from there. 35-31. Allow nothing over the top. They need a touchdown. They have time. Nothing over the top. This would be a huge upset and a big comeback. Kaepernick has time. He's going to run. He's going to slide. I just don't know how we stop that. We can get a QB contain on there. That might help out a little bit. Don't know about how much, though. And that's open. That's okay, though. We'll keep them in bounds. Timeout, Washington. QB contain. They're deep over the top. They have it. They have it. They have it. And he dropped it. That's our momentum bonus. Away team has trouble catching. Coach suggestions is goal line? It's fourth and one, but... Guy, look at the situation. They can get the first. I don't care. We cannot get beat over the top. We just had a linebacker running down the field with no help deep. That's really where we were. We'll give them the first down. I don't care. We cannot be in man coverage. The CPU is killing me with these play calls. Dude, where is anybody? Where is anybody? We keep them in bounds, though. They're going to have to call that timeout. 20 seconds left in the game. And my coverage is horrific right now. And look at cover six invert. I get it. However, I flipped the play. I don't know where the deep zone was. I feel like that's deep. Just back these guys up. Keep them in front of you. Keep them in bounds. If they go over the middle, that's great. It doesn't matter. Kaepernick all day. Lobs it up. That one is... Dropped in the end zone. Oh my god. After the tip. That was heartbreak. That was heartbreak. I saw it. Get after it. Anzalone. Free shot. Davidson. Incomplete. I hit Kaepernick so late. It's ridiculous, by the way. No flag. Third and ten. Get deep. Anzalone blitz. We're going to blitz Soro as well. Forced the ball out earlier. Back foot. Lobbed it up. Davidson intercepted out of bounds. Game over. Lions win. The Lions win. Huge come from behind victory. We almost blew the comeback and we came back again to win anyway. What a roller coaster of the game or of a game and we win. We are undefeated in the Black Unis. Oh my. What a game. Pass for 342. Rush for 153. Two total pressures for both teams in the game. We got the ball out quickly. Offensive line performed pretty well. Which was good. I mean, I got pressured by Chase Young, I feel like, a little bit. But, man, what a comeback. We were down the entire game. Took it on that final drive, and then we held on. I mean, Paul Garrison did throw an interception, a big one at that. But overall was fantastic. Weird RPO confusion. I didn't really have any incompletions this game for the most part. 75% completion percentage is phenomenal. Couldn't really get a running game going with Rashad Reese. They did have a touchdown, though. DeAndre Swift was good, 11 for 62, but we're, you know, basically splitting those carries, and Paul Garrison's running two. He had a touchdown, did fumble twice. One was out of bounds. Solomon Clifford had an attempt, and we just completely shut down their, their rushing attack. I mean, 1.4 for Antonio Gibson, 2.5 for Max Simmons. They couldn't get anything going. Rashad Reese is a receiver, 12 catches for 171. Tyrell had a touchdown. Chris Godwin with a touchdown. Chris Godwin very casually has, like, double-digit touchdowns this year, I think. Alex Anzalone, eight tackles, two for loss. 
We had a sack for Deshaun Hand. No interceptions. What a game, man. What a game. What an upset. What a performance. I'm stoked. Huge game. They wanted us to get a blowout win. I, I don't know if that was ever going to happen. But a huge win nonetheless. How many touchdowns does Chris Godwin have? Did we not check from here? Feels like we should be able to check from here, but nope. What do we what do we want him to improve? Deep route running. Gotta be. Gotta be deep threat. So deep route running. Spectacular catch release. All things I think he could really improve upon. Plus three deep route running's big. Plus one spectacular catch. See, he's not really a bomb it deep kind of guy. He's really a possession guy. He's not going to go out and make these aggressive catches. He does have the trait, but he's not going to make these aggressive catches based on his spectacular catch, his release, deep route running. It's like, that's why he doesn't get deep over the top of guys. It's just not his game. His ratings do not reflect it at all. I mean, Quintess Cephas is a pretty similar way. We'll do a, we'll do deep threat for him as well. Try to get these guys a little bit better down the field. Quintess Cephas is always open. Can't really complain about him. He is he is awesome. But, I mean, what a huge game. These guys played their heart out. We're 4-10. It's just, it's just a major win. Great job this week. We just showed the league that even though we didn't start the year's playoff caliber team, we're going to finish this one. It, it, it is super true. We're just playing better football. Coach Dangus, I'm really proud of this team. There's no quitting these guys. This win could really be a nice building block for us moving into next season. So we should get some big boosts here. Paul Garrison, DeAndre Swift, and Dorian Tompkins get 10,000 XP. And 10 staff points for the staff as well. So, I mean, that 10,000 XP is actually, like, pretty massive. Not going to lie to you. And we could get another win here against the Texans. Like, Garrison gets two skill points because of that. Like, that's huge. That is so, so, so big, especially when it costs 6,000 for him to get up to the next tier. Paul Garrison, I mean, is clearly becoming QB1 in front of our very eyes, week in, week out. Plus one through accuracy deep is all we get. Let's go back to field general to get the scheme fit as the primary. Plus two through accuracy deep, plus two play action. Garrison's just getting better. He's just getting better. 21 years old. I wish we could upgrade his speed. I know 83 is pretty good, but I'd, I'd like it to be like 85. And then Dorian Tompkins. I think a big reason that he's not getting after the quarterback right now is morale. It's just taking down his ratings. Power Rusher gives him plus one power moves and finesse moves, plus two tackling, plus three play rec. So really just an overall bump there, despite not really getting a whole lot better. Like better, but not a whole lot better. And then DeAndre Swift. I mean, he is... I don't want to say turning into RB1 because he, he's like clearly running back one, right? But he splits carries with Rashad Reese. Like, those are not exactly huge gains. He's up to an 85 overall with morale, like, killing him. Awareness by... Like, these are not big upgrades. I don't know where we are in that. Still haven't done anything with the staff points. But man, this team... 4-10. and ten. We're likely going to lose the Packers in Week 18. And Deshaun Watson we have to face here in Week 16. But we could beat the Texans and Giants in Week 17 uh, and Week 16, respectively. So we're in a really, really good spot here. We're coming back. We're fighting. Are we still the worst record in the league? We're not. We're not. We're climbing out. I, I, that's so dumb, by the way, that I just said, are we still the worst record in the league? Looking at a 3-11 and team? Forget about me. Uh, just hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. Check me out on Twitter, twitter.com slash bangle YouTube. And of course, the podcast link is down in the description too, Couch Quarterbacks Podcast. Would appreciate you guys checking that out. And uh, YouTube channel as well, I'll link. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy. Over you, yeah, yeah. I'ma turn taking it back to the house. Keep us a joke. I'm laughing so loud.